what you want to Please don't be polite Cause I like your attitude Let's Hey guys, welcome back to another video So today I decided to do a different kind of video Because I don't know, I've been having this problem, um, you know, since I had the twins and probably further back before I had any babies to begin with. And that's my insecurity. So there's a lot of things I'm insecure about my body. Well, I guess there's a lot of things on my body that I'm so insecure about that y'all probably like Jasmine, I didn't even know that. Um, I just feel some type of way about it and I just really have been trying to cover up and just act like, you know, I... I'm perfect, I don't know, I guess. But you know what, I'm tired of acting like that. And I just wanna come on here and just be completely honest and real with y'all. And one thing, of course y'all probably already know, is my body, period. Um, my body didn't snap back how it did with any of my children. I had to do extra stuff to get my body to how I want it to be. And I hate it, I hate the way it looks. Um, some men might think it's good, mine think it's, um, I guess you could say he's okay with it because he's like, you know what, you blessed me with kids and I'm not going to sit here and complain about how you look. I'm not going to lie. In the past, we did have a disagreement about this and he was not happy with how I looked and I was just like, you know what, I was depressed and I, that's another thing. I was depressed about it and I just hated the way I looked and I felt like I was always down and out and he didn't like the way how I was acting, acting because of how I looked and that affected everything. Like. 100 like it affected everything to the point of even sexually i didn't want to have sex because i was like i don't want him to see this body and everything he was like you know what i'm happy with what you have you are we've been together this long i'm not gonna sit here and judge you so on and so on so that's one thing i'm insecure about and that's my stomach i don't know if you can see it but my stomach i hate it number two uh, number, no, the second thing that i'm insecure about is my boobs now i breastfed who cares i don't give a damn i had Four kids, so who gives a damn? Now I'm kind of like I don't care, but I'm still insecure about it. But is he saggy? I'm sorry, y'all. These saggy boobies, and like I try everything to get them up. And I've actually been googling stuff and looking on Amazon for different bras to try to get them back perky because they they're not perky no more. The third thing that I'm insecure about is my arms. I hate this, y'all. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I don't know how many times I can stress that. I hate the little. F I've been trying so hard to do different workouts to get this down. I'm insecure about this, and I. I don't know. I hate it. I hate the back, back, all of it, everything with my arms. I cannot stand it. Now, a lot of people have tried to talk about me before about this, and um, it hasn't. I'm not gonna say it hasn't bothered me, but I have seen the comments, and I have seen the or heard the negative you know bullshit people have said about it is my face i break out i don't know it's been like this since i was young i've always just broke out really bad and because i'm not going to talk about that in this video but i've had days whenever i had the girls now that's for another video i want to talk to y'all about but um since i had the girls i was kind of stressed out mostly Kaylin. Like I said, Minfa was not always on good terms. We always we had our bad spills and it led to me picking my face. And I still kind of do it sometimes, but I try not to. I try to stay away from it and leave it alone. I even try to put makeup on my face to cover it up. Um, a lot of people try to talk about me and say, you know, uh, what they call me <laughs> is a uh, hoe ass call me crater face or some shit. But you know what? I don't know. I can't change it, I can't change this about myself. This is real life and my life is just, I can't, I mean, I don't have a whole bunch of money to where I can go and get my face done type stuff. So this is one other thing that I'm insecure about. Another thing is my legs, I hate them. And um, a lot of people try to talk about my legs too and I don't like them, like can you tell? I have, since I had the twins, I got these little, I don't know y'all. And I hate them, and they're on both legs, so I'm about to see. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, like, I'm not perfect, my body isn't perfect. I'm just giving it to you day by day on what's going on with me, and this is like really what's going on with me. And I think this also has a lot to do with my postpartum depression, but you know what? I'm trying my best, my hardest, to get my body back to the way I want to get it back to, to, you know, basically the slim, thick em Jasmine whenever I was like coming into college and, you know, I love that body and I really miss it. But hey, you know, when you have kids, God bless me with four beautiful kids. But of course, it has me feeling some type of way about my body. But 
comes with the territory. The reason I'm sharing this video because I know there's a lot of women out there that are probably like, I'm so insecure about my body and how it looks, especially the ones that just had a baby and I'm just like, you know what? Don't give up on yourself. Keep pushing, keep grinding to where you wanna be. You wanna look fine, you wanna look slim thick, don't give up. Okay, you might fall off sometimes. I'm not gonna sit here and sugarcoat it. I fell off off my weight loss journey. I fell off maybe three times and I have a binge eating problem. I will binge eat and y'all, it's so bad to the point that I get depressed after I eat. And that's another thing that I'm insecure about, but you know what, I'm gonna keep it real and I'm just keeping it real because I know there's people out there that need that. They need that extra push and they need the, you know, someone to relate to and so they don't feel like, damn, am I the only one feeling this way? No, you're not because look at me. I'm making this video for you to let you know that you're not alone. We're gonna stick to this together. We're gonna get our bodies how we want our bodies to look together, okay? And I know pregnant moms out there, don't, 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 don't complain about the baby. Uh, don't complain about the pregnant body. It gets better. And then sometimes just try, after you have the baby, try your hardest to stick to some kind of diet. Because after I had the twins, I was like, bitch, look at that body. Just, no, no. And then I just bounce back to this. And I'm just like, what the fuck? But I just wanna do this video, so like I said, to reach out to people that might have the same situation that I'm having. And it's okay, because you know what? We are gonna do this together. I love you guys so much. Thank you guys so much for watching and supporting me. And thank you so much for the 10K subscribers. Y'all are super amazing. Make sure y'all share and like this video because I'm pretty sure there's people out there that's going through the same thing that we're going through. And I feel like if we can get this video out there, let's get this video to like, 5k views let's get this video out there into like 500 thumbs up i mean all all interactions i don't care if thumbs down this video who cares all interactions make a difference and i hope y'all enjoyed this video like i said y'all are amazing i love you guys so much and thank you guys so much so damn much for just being here for me and my family because i don't know what i'll do without y'all's positive vibes in the comment section i love you guys deuces and smooches catch you later